Hi guys, Jessica here with a book review. I have a few for you today. The first one is on Helen, Ellen Hopkins Glass. If you're familiar with her, she's written Crank. This is the sequel to Crank, um, which it says, This continues the story begun in my first novel, Crank. Both books are loosely based on the very real story of my daughter's walk with the monster drug, Crystal Meth. So, this talks about... Um, the first one talks about how she initially becomes um, active with it and then uh, she gets pregnant and it's this whole thing and the book is actually very shocking there's many twists and turns you don't expect um, what to happen I read this entire thing in one sitting um, it's all prose and as you can see you know poems and so it's, it's it's like this on a page I mean there's not it's not full pages. So, um, this book is really interesting. She has Crank. She has, um, Impulse. I've read Impulse. She has this glass. I haven't read Fallout, which is the newest, I believe. Identical and Burned. Here are some. They don't show Fallout. Um, where is it? Um, hmm. Where is it? They have a little, like, like a little intro kind of to get you want to read uh, Fallout. I didn't read it. <laughs> um, but I'm really interested in reading Burned and Identical. So um, what I like about her books is that while it's written in a fun tone, the way that she writes and the way that she presents her book, she gets young readers, young, you know, YA, uh, teens to read these books and they learn about the reality of what drugs will do to their family, to themselves, to anyone around them. And I think it's a really powerful tool that she's used in order to kind of influence uh, today's, you know, teens. So, um, like I said, I read it in one sitting. I usually read these kind of books in one sitting just because you really are invested in the character and really want to know what happens. And it's kind of like this sick obsession we have about drugs is that we don't realize that this could be a real story and this is a real story of someone's daughter. Um, it's like a soap opera in front of our eyes, but for some people it's a reality. So that is my review on Glass. I do recommend this if you do kind of like um, books like that. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Stay tuned for my next video.